Yo, what up guys, CO2 on Tamed here, and I am stuck on the door. I am on FS22, yeah, yeah, been a minute, you guys are blowing this shit up, we'll turn on the light, I'm gonna try shutting the door, it's, you know, it's still kind of cold, but, uh, yeah, I did quite a bit, and, uh, I have got my girlfriend, yeah, it's, uh, it's an SRT, it has some horsepower, but she wanted a charger, with this cutter and look how beautiful it looks it does look clean it does have the OD light strip right there it's pretty sick that's hers because uh you know she's seen that uh, I've been buying all this stuff so uh she wanted she wanted her a car too but uh yeah I got the bourbon this vehicle is very special to me because it's a uh, yeah it's kind of like a replica other than the, the logos are wrong it's Chevy but you gotta listen what I did to this old girl because she sounds nasty right now. All right, three, two, one. It sounds so good. <laughs> it sounds amazing. We're not gonna take that for the ride because uh, the main video Turn that off. The main video is about buying this uh, this clean OBS that I saw on Facebook Marketplace. But uh, first off, have you seen that Ford, that Ford video? And that was the last FS22 video I made. This is what it looks like now. It's very clean, very yeah, very clean, very sick looking. I like it. But uh, I thought about selling it because. You know, try making some money back. Harvest season's coming up eventually, so I plan on selling this. And uh, yeah, but uh, as you could see in here, why the doors open because they just dropped it off. Is this uh, second gen? That's uh very bad. Oh, it's very glitchy. Oh, it's right there. But yeah, let's pop the hood on that. As you can, you know, see, everything looks pretty clean under there. It got wrecked, and then someone stole the wheels. But uh, I bought this from the whatever they're called, the dealership sale. I saw it on there for auction. I was like, all right, you know, I could sit here, I could buy this truck. Tailgate even comes down. That's sick. I don't know how to click that on controller, but. Good thing we got our mouse. But yeah, very clean. It already has the ball hitch. So my plan was is to find a dually bed out there. Take the ball hitch out of that. Throw it in that dually bed. And this could be another towing rig. Since, you know, it's all K30. I love my K30. But I have something a little bit newer. Because, you know, they're they're expensive. I won't lie. And the paint's... You know, it's, it's been getting worked, been getting used. So that's my plan with this. Add some aftermarket stuff. Actually add a grill back in since that's missing. Add some, uh, well, looks to me like front CV axle. I don't, you know, uh, it's missing some stuff. So, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's pretty bad. I don't know what happened, but pretty much it was just sitting on its rims and stuff and axles. So I got to repaint everything uh, under there. Was originally on the rims well I jacked it up took the rims off cuz and it was just stock Dodge rims and uh and I use that as my jack stands right now cuz uh I haven't really been to the store but I know the biggest thing you guys are probably wondering like co2 what happened to your shop and I was like well I hated it that's what I was saying a whole year went by and uh I still have this truck, that's what I was saying. I didn't really buy anything new other than that. And did some motor stuff, harvest season. And, uh, so yeah, it took, uh, it didn't take that long. I hired some Amish people. And they built the sumbitch in, like, a matter of, uh, months. Not that long. They tore it all down, they used all that. Actually, some, you know, as you could see, some of the material they threw right back in this. And look at this barnuminium. It has its own little shop right there, house. I'll show you the interior. Because I got my, my two bikes in here. 
Got a little PC setup, stove burner, and some beautiful, beautiful stuff. A bathroom too with the, the bed and the blankets. And a nice shower. A nice barnuminium. Big old buck. So yeah. And also I did not forget about the Chevy. A beautiful Chevy. I'm trying to remember everything. Because uh, I got to go pick up this OBS. I still have those trucks. Uh, last video. The Ford. It's a little damaged. So I kind of just towed it right here. I don't know really what exactly broke on it, but you know, it's not running right. I don't I don't know exactly cuz I haven't looked at it. All I did was drag it here. It does fire up and move and stuff, but you know, I figured double check cuz it's making some clunk of noise in the front end, you know, especially over there, it pulls to the right a little bit, especially how I I landed. It. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. God did not watch the last video. I'd check it out. We got like FS22, but uh, another thing is big shout out to all you guys subscribing. I'm at 412 subscribers when making this video, and uh, yeah, thank you all. I love y'all. You guys are awesome. But now we're actually gonna get back in the main video, since probably at the end of this video, um, I might start working on that Dodge actually do that maybe not i don't know but we're gonna go pick up this uh this obs here because this obs is clean very clean but we got the trailer hooked up everything hooked up all right i'll see you guys soon as we get to the guy's house all right guys we have officially made it to the guy's property i actually just got done talking to him i had to drop the rams but I already paid him, gave him his cash, he gave me the keys and the title, but I want to show you guys before I load this beautiful baby up, like how clean this looks, like look at that, that, mm. I think it was like a 96 Chevy Silverado, 2500, oh, but look how clean that looks, it looks so beautiful, let's get this baby loaded up, it has LED lights, I like working and building on stuff, but man, when, you know, it saves a lot more work, especially when you kind of got the, just got the money to buy it right there off hand. Like that, like, look, ooh. I need to come over a little bit, but she, she's rowdy. Try getting that, that thumbnail right there. Mm. Like, look at that. That's clean. But he does say it doesn't need brake pads. It's, uh, the stopping seems a little slow on this which probably turn off the lights that, that's a big thing co2 you can't drive down the road like that we're gonna strap this big boy down put a strap there put a strap over there if it won't strap so we'll put another strap right there new strap there you go there you go okay let's get the big boy these trailer ramps up and uh yeah since we got some LED lights on this too I figure we can uh, cruise with our LEDs on, but I'll see you guys soon as we get back to the shop. All right, guys, we made it back. Uh, very clean OPS. It's been and it's been a little bit, but uh, we got this built and finished and painted and everything, so that's sitting out here now. All we did was uh find uh some stuff online. I went to AutoZone and they had, luckily they had the kit right there where you could just screw that on, ribbit it down, or ribbit it on, add a dually kit with some bling bings. We, we added a lot of horsepower, it went from like 300 to 1100, so a new towing rig. And uh, yeah, but if you got did enjoy this video, hit that like button and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Goodbye.